Hi everybody, it's Annie. Um, just uh, wanted to share this with you before I uh, send it off. This is uh, a wall hanging I've done. Uh, Janet and I've done a, decided we wanted to do a swap. And anyway, she asked for one of my wall hangings and I asked for one of her journals. And uh, that's what we, you know, decided to do. And, um, Anyway, this is the wall hanging I made for her, and she likes vintage images of ladies. Um, so I found this lady here, and I thought she was really pretty, and I thought Janet would like it, or I hope she likes it. Anyway, hi Janet, um, and uh, of course I won't post this video till after she has received her, you know, received the package. So anyway, let's just get started here, uh, and I'm gonna have to move this a little bit to. I'm going to start at the top. Now, this is my basket that that I got, uh, Claire sent me, but uh, I'll take that off so you can see the hanger. Uh, I made the hanger, and um, I just covered it all in lace, and um, it's got Prima flowers and some double bows, and this is some just, um, I don't know, I think it's more like, it comes like ribbon, but it's more like trim or something. But anyway, it's just leaves, and I just thought it looked real cute uh, on that. And um, anyway, the reason I'm hanging it on this basket, this basket's tall enough that I can show you a little bit of this. But and then here's the clips, and I put the same centers uh, there as I did up here on that, kind of tie it all together. And um, then uh, lace across the top. It's got like three or four layers of lace here. I know it's all the same colors, so it's a little hard to um, see the different laces. And some more prima flowers and leaves and some, you know, a little trim off of it. And like here's a, okay, I got this all around the whole picture. And then here's a layer of lace. And there's another one. And then this right here with the pearls is a layer. And then here's some. And then there's one here. And then there's also a layer behind. But I'll turn it around and show you. Um, and uh, I put some little, a few little flowers and pearls scattered them around and um, I think I can set this down now and show you the rest of it um, and then of course here's a uh, some prima most of these are prima except for these I think I got these in downtown in the garment district or something but and then some more of the the trim and I kind of left it I did not attach it all over because I wanted it to, to look three dimensional so I only attached it in spots and uh, I don't know I just think it makes it look I don't know gives it more depth and I, I thought this lady I thought she was so so pretty and um, so anyway and then here's just a, like I said the cluster of flowers and then on the bottom um sorry I used this uh, lace that you know just to give it some more movement and I just thought it looked really pretty it looks really pretty when it's hanging up against the wall gives it a little more movement and I don't know a little more dimension and then here's a layer and then here's this the other layer with the pearls across um, and then here's another layer and then back behind here I don't know if you guys can really tell it but there's like this all the way around it and then here's a a layer and then here's some another layer of lace and um, it's just the colors are all um, from what I'm seeing on my camera the colors are um, well they're all in the same family they're all creams and beiges but on the camera it kind of looks like they're all the same but anyway that's that and then on the back of it I use this vintage um, I don't know what it is 
I know I bought it at an estate sale and uh, this was the size of it exactly what you're seeing that's the exact size of it I didn't cut on it and it's got a butterfly in the middle and uh, like I said I bought it at a, an estate sale and it I bought it with several other older pieces and I'm sure this is an old piece but like I said I don't know what it is maybe a square um, instead of a round doily maybe they used you know had a square piece like it because it's really not that's the only thing I can think of it had to be something that you know they would put on top of a dresser and set a piece of glass or something you know that they used and um, but anyway I decided it was real pretty and it looked really nice for the back of for the back of the uh, piece and then inside that uh, I just have sandwiched a piece of uh, the cream color felt in between that and the, the image on the front uh, and uh, then also here there's this trim all around that I added all around the edge of the piece to finish it off and of course you can see some of the the uh, little leaves and some of the little flowers that are you know coming out the side of it but that's okay I always just like to finish my piece so anyway Janet this is coming your way and uh, I enjoyed doing it it was a lot of fun and uh, I hope you like it and anyway I'll speak to you guys soon bye